Greetings and welcome to For some reason Austria seems to like us uh, They desire a lot of our provinces But they seem to want to ally us And I think I will take the alliance for now And if I conquer anything I'll probably conquer Italian stuff So aggressive expansion in Europe has fallen Oh, they're still in the coalition Has fallen a lot um, Which leaves us Capable, open and capable to attacking England I am going to ally Austria Friendly attitude towards Byzantium Well, that probably changed when I changed my rivalries, England and France, and the rival to France. Oh right, so that probably changed. Yeah, enemy of enemy for twenty months. So it's that uh, France has rivaled both me and him. Not actually that we both rival France, but France decided to rival us both. Now Austria is going to be a really useful ally against uh, France and probably against all of Europe because he's like a buffer zone against the coalitions that will form against me when I conquer all this stuff here so maybe I should change my focus and instead of conquering Anatolia for now I conquer the main colonial nations so I become the only power able and willing to colonize Thank you, Austria. You're a good guy. Now, um, we went to six of four relations because uh, we're in a war. We're in defensive war, though. But we are soon going to join an offensive war. And when you join an offensive war... Oh, it's not even our war. Right. I don't know how we're able to ally Austria mid-war, but yeah. Okay. So he was going there. And did we want to attack Fran uh, England right now? I think we did. Okay, 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 okay. Really important war now. Conquest of Pale. This one stays here, is okay. And he should go here. It's a level 2 fort, so I can get 10 cannons to go there get these troops to go there this here, this here so I can reinforce at any point I need to and let's get these guys with this general here now what, I'm hope what I am hoping for is thank you Austria, you're a good man what I am hoping for is I take these seeds this siege is fast before England consolidates. Yeah, I can't go anywhere else. So he can attack me. Um, this is a woods territory, so I'm gonna get a minus one from woods. Yeah, because I am considered to be the attacker because I'm sieging the fort. And then probably I'm going to take the river crossing too if he doesn't attack from Lancaster. So I want to take this territory as fast as possible. Also, um, we'll try to sink his 10 heavies with our 100 fleet, but we're probably going to lose a lot of ships. <coughs> what was it again now? Uh, we can't ask for a general, but we can ask for an admiral. And I am going to ask for an admiral. Oh! Mm, fuck, we had the super girl admiral, right? I forgot about that. Oh, it's okay. We're not in... Uh... So, Cossack aggression. Um, which country is it? So, <laughs> our Cossacks are attacking the steppe nomads. Uh, they're not steppe nomads, but they're nomads. 
Timurid countryside as the Cossacks responsible is in our border. Timurids have now demanded both compensation. <coughs> well, <coughs> how good are the Timurids doing? They're winning against this war. They're in the coalition. And if I... Hmm. Should I make my Cossacks even more happy? Well... Did we decide... Yeah, we decided that Timurids would never leave the coalition against us. Anyways. So let's go like this then. <coughs> okay. Okay, so we got pale. We don't need this mercenary anymore. And let's hope that our ships do their work. Okay, so instantly we start uh, uh, getting damaged by his ships. We are going to lose ships. It is obvious to me now. Is there some kind of... Um, oh, there's something like... There's something called engagement width. So more ships don't make any difference. Uh, land maneuver, coastal sea. Leader maneuver. Now luckily we have the super girl. <laughs> the names. Okay, so... I will just lose ships. I accept that. Oh, he... We lost ships and he retreated. Mamluks have entered the coalition against us. <coughs> okay. There's a shipyard here. <coughs> Let's build the rest of the ships that were destroyed. Here and here. Is okay. Now, where is the rest of his army? I don't think I can fight that. Hmm. What's up, Mamluks? What the fuck? What's your problem, man? Probably very load. Okay, we can get Hejaz to leave the coalition then. And maybe the coalition will weaken then. What is the coalition? Genoa, the horde is fighting us. He's probably gonna leave after the peace treaty with uh, Russia. Okay, let's hope the siege finishes quickly before he consolidates the troops. Okay, this is kind of okay. This might work. Um, where are the rebels? Some here. And there are he rebels here. Are we converting them? Yeah. We're converting them. Oh, nice. Uh, wall bridge. Wall bridge is really good. It accelerates the thing a lot. He's moving. Uh, I'll do this. Nice. Okay. 
So he's leaving. Now what happens if I move my ships there? Okay, so how is the terrain? Um, Marsis. We want to be attacked in here. Or in here. And over a river. This is a good one too. <coughs> oh, he's not afraid of me. Oh fuck! Okay, so as it seems, the English forced a fight on us. Okay, we have uh, civil service, prestige, and plus three percent missionary strength. This is really great, and we can make more states. What were the states we really wanted to make? <coughs> So, Astrakhani is 55 development, and Hudavendigar is 48. So, this one will become a state, for sure. Well, yes, we can't call now. Hmm. This one has a lot of autonomy. And Astrakhan. Well, yeah, let's make this state too. Oh, we wanted this, we wanted to make these states, so let's not make Astrakhan a state. Uh, we want the Silk provinces to be states, so yeah. How many states more can we make? One more state Astrakhan, Dagestan. <coughs> One in England, maybe? This one? Don't feel it's worth making a state. Okay, we'll, we'll do one in England, probably, then. How is the fighting going? Timurids left the coalition. The English retreated. Um. Genoa has left the coalition. England has only 1000 manpower and 10 mercenaries. Okay, who else are we fighting against England? No one, just England. No colonies, no nothing. Uh, we can just eat England up. Now, <coughs> I preferably... So France is okay with England, for some reason, no. 
just wants Austrian territory. And he's chilling with England. England wants all the shit back, but... Okay. How much development does France have? Oh, we can see it here, right. France has 784 development. England is not even in the top 8. Okay. Um, okay, so 120 administrative points, 25% of that is uh, 90, divided by 2 is 45, so this actually is uh, efficient, we don't lose anything, we lose no points at all when doing this. Oh, we, we also need to do press some stuff. Right. We have some new core thingies. But we can't do anything because we haven't cored them yet, so... Well, I guess I can give the nobility some stuff here. No? 0% autonomy, everything. <coughs> Okay, um, where is there anything? Okay, Crete can be given to the clergy. When this is given, well, this one can be given to the clergy, right? For now. Oh, yeah, the disaster thingy. Um, how about we take something from the clergy now? <laughs> I can't find anything to take from them. <laughs> Sugla, maybe? Give it to the nobles. Okay, and we'll see what we'll do with the clergy. Uh, diplomatic power. Rebel factions. Um, Mentesi. Sugla. What? Okay, um, this guy can go there. Okay, we integrated Serbia. Uh, conquer Teke. Where is that? Well... Okay. Um, Sylvan is building a marketplace. Well, <coughs> I want to convert Sylvan goods produced so we produce more silk. Let's convert it after the other ones then. 
Okay. <clears throat> now we integrated Serbia, so we should have gotten Serbia's army. It seems to be this one. And. Mm, doesn't seem like there are any other armies. We're losing a lot of manpower because we're not micromanaging um, expanded supply trains. What is that? Hmm. Quantity. And does defensive have land attrition too? Nice. You can you can get land attrition really low and stack like hundreds of thousands of troops in one specific area. <coughs> now, look at this. This is beautiful. We have a fuck ton of missionary strength. Uh, also, we can build a workshop there and a church there. Thank you very much. <coughs> I'm not gonna help the sieges with the ships because I'm afraid of losing my ships and at this point the war is almost completely won um, what? Uh, no thank you very much no, thank you very much. Defenders Desert. They're running back to London. Okay, we got this one. And... Okay, let's do this. Okay, this is the one with the horses. Hmm, the horses go to bad places. But yeah, as it seems, uh, it's, a, it's a full front line anyways. So the cannons do most of the work. Not most, but a lot of the work. And... He's running back to London, probably. QQ entered the coalition against us. Okay. Now the Hezazi left the coalition. Um, how about we try um, supporting an air in Poland again? Seems like a new one is up. But with the minus three um, diplomatic reputation we have from annexing the vassals. Doesn't seem like a good idea. Let's improve relations with Wallachia to get them to plus hundreds. Now, how is the coalition against us? The Timurids left the coalition. Why? <coughs> 